Hello, Jack. Hello, teacher. Alright, we're going to have ourselves a little speaking test here. Alright, there's four parts to the speaking test. Let's go ahead and jump right in. Part one, there are two pictures, right? My picture is just about the same as yours, but there are some different things. For example, my picture has two elephants. Your picture has one elephant. Alright? First, I'm going to tell you something about my picture, and then you tell me how your picture is different. Okay? All right. And picture, in picture, in my picture, my picture, the girls are eating ice cream. But my picture, the, the Romans talking on the phone. All right, good. And my picture, there's a woman taking a photo. But my picture, the, the man taking the photo. All right, good. In my picture, there's a baby in a carriage crying. That's the picture. My picture, the baby is sleeping. Good. In my picture, there is a red backpack next to the man. But the picture, the backpack is brown. All right. In my picture, there is a dog sitting behind the bin. But the picture. So dog is in front of the bin. Good. In my picture, there is an old woman reading a book. But in my picture, the woman is across the back. Alright. Good. Alright, let's see here. Alright, let's see. Alright, moving on to the second part. Alright, I'll give this to you. This is yours. Alright, so in this part, Sarah and Harry have both got new books. But I don't know anything about Harry's book, but you do, so I'm going to ask you some questions, okay? All right, what is the name of the book? It is the Silly Boat. All right. And who gave the book to Harry? Fine. All right, what is the book about? What is it? Okay. And was the book interesting or boring? Boring. Okay. When did Harry finish the book? Just Good. Now, you don't know anything about Sarah's book, but I do. So now you ask me questions. Who Harry who Harry gave a book? Um her cousin. What's the name of the book? The Star. What about a book? Um, it's about a singer. When Sir Sarah finished the book? She finished it last week. Was the book interesting or boring? It was interesting. Alright, good. Alright, good to see you. All right, so this is part three. Um, these pictures tell a story. It's called the camera. So just take a look. See this? Just take a look at these. One, two, three, four, five. I will tell you about picture one, okay? So in picture one, there's a family who are having a picnic. The father is taking a photo of the mother and two children. They all look very happy. Now, you tell me the rest of the story, okay? You tell me about picture two, three, four, and five. The family finished the picnic. The family come back to the car. But the, the boy, oh, the boy says, he, the family got for a camera. And for the, the boy cut to the car, and it says you got for the camera. The 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 dust is come. The dust is down the car, and the boy is keep about keep camera about to the family. Alright. Alright. Final part here. All right. So um, now I'm going to ask you a few personal questions, okay? Okay. All right. Let's talk about your weekend, okay? okay. 
All right, um, first question. What time do you wake up on Saturdays? I wake up <clears throat> at 6 o'clock. All right. Who makes breakfast on Saturdays? My mom. Okay. What do you do with your family on Saturdays? So I wash or brush the teeth. All right. Where do you go on Sundays? Uh, I ride a bike. Okay. Tell me about what you like to do on Sunday evenings. I like playing football on the morning Saturday. All right, cool. All right, well, thank you very much. And that will be all, Jack. So you have a good one. Bye-bye. Okay.